I swear I just heard a chest close. That's very strange. Nobody in my house. Eh, must be imagining things. Why, hello guys, and welcome back to another episode on the Afterlife SMP. I have a, a tiny confession to make. I want to show you guys my secret stash. <laughs> the head, the head that Tink gave me. But I also have a whole bunch of sponges and prismarine. And you might be wondering to yourself, Kafers, where did you get these things? And the answer is, whilst I was getting ready to build my house in last episode, Tink and I raided an ocean monument. You're fine. Yes, I'll do most of the fighting. You can do most of the cowering. <laughs> Sounds about right, yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's doors it. <laughs> right, jump in the boat. I'm let's in the boat. ride. I mean this will probably be faster for you. Um however, I do not have an elytra. So you're gonna have to get in my boat! <laughs> now last time I was in that boat with you, Capers. We ended up doing a raid, so that better uh, not happen this time round. This I feel like this is like a kind of worse. <laughs> Did I mention this is quite a long boat ride? <laughs> <laughs> now, if my memory serves me right, which it usually doesn't, <laughs> um, it's kind of close to like an ice biome, right? Yes, yeah, that's correct. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's go in the front! Place uh, down the door if you need air. Oh, yeah, got it. Hey, leave her alone. <laughs> help me, help me! <laughs> Where's the big one? Alright. Oh, you got it. it. Nice. We can share the loot after we're done. Cool. Ow. Alright, now the next one should be on the opposite end of the... Hey, leave her alone. Go away. Whoa, Dolphin's Grace, let's go. Wee. Wait, what? Someone's been here? No! Oh my god, there's like a... No way. Ah, ah, let me in, let me in, let me in. Jeez. Eat, 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 eat. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Run around the doors. Alright, that's <laughs> at that end, because we got the whatever it's called. I don't know what to do, because we have the whatever effect it's called. Fatigue. And it's blocked by calcite. It's blocked by a freaking geode. Really? Oh, we could just dig yeah. our way through. We can't. Why not? Mining fatigue. Oh god, yeah, of course. Right. Oh, what do we do? Okay, can well... we go around uh, can we go around the other way? Yeah, there should be an entrance to that. Hang on, I'm running out of air. He's gonna damage me, but I got... <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> yeah, they're killing me. Oh, dear. That capers at all costs. <laughs> that is your mission. That is your mission. Uh, I was so close to death then. <laughs> Stupid fishes. <laughs> Stupid fishes. I'm going up. Okay. Yeah, but you're going all the way up. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many of them, Dink! There's so many of them! I don't know how I'm going to survive this. Oh, there's so many of them hitting me. No! Don't, don't no! Die. I am definitely going to die now. No, yep. no, I'm defo dead. I'm dead. I'm so, yeah, you? I'm dead. <laughs> where are you? God damn it! Uh, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, I'm here, I think. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Yay! <laughs> My hero! <laughs> I got you a present. Here you go. Oh, really? I picked Where your sunflower. You? You <laughs> hey, nice. All right, let me see. That's yours. Yay, that's my yours, stuff. That's yours, that's yours, that's yours. As a reward, uh, Tink, I'll let, you, I'll let you name one of my, uh, one of my tools. Look at all this prismarine, look at all these sponges! <gasps> Amazing. Name your tool. Yeah, they have to be named after songs. What would you like? None, none of them have names yet. Man, putting me on the spot right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take my axe off you. Is that too long? Yeah, no, that, that should do it. Can't, but you'll have to name it because I have no levels. <laughs> uh, I have 58. There you go. I'll take my axe off. <laughs> Wait, that is the name of the song, right? Can't take my eyes off of you. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, it's gonna be I'll axed. accept. I'll accept the pun. <laughs> I can't take my axe off you. Yes, look at that. That's Brilliant. great. <laughs> Thanks, Tinkfro. That was great. It was terrible, no but it was great. <laughs> it was fun. That's all that matters. Indeed, indeed. Well, I can take down my pillar of shame now. <laughs> Okay, so obviously I'm not the best at 
raiding ocean monuments, but it was very generous of Ting to come and give me some materials. In the meantime, I have been planning out my very first canal. This is going to be leading right up to the ocean here, and I'm thinking about just having a dam at the end of it, and then building up these two sides here, and all of this, and all of that. Yeah, I'm going to be doing a lot of terraforming. Speaking of which, I'm going to need quite a bit of dirt, and I'm fairly sure that I read something on the Discord server about that. Need dirt? Don't have a place to get any? Puff Enterprises is allowing any member to come to the pictured location and mine grass, dirt and stone at any Y level above 30. You can do this within the square area outlined by jungle planks. Well, I think that's where we're going. Got a lot of discord. And now I have a bit of dirt. I didn't have much room in my inventory, but I think this is probably gonna get us started for now. So uh, let's build a canal. So I was just laying down some dirt to kind of gauge like what the area would look like with it all kind of flat. And I happened to notice a bee, a poor lost bee. Let's grab a flower and see if we can rescue it. Come on, bee friend. Come on, come this way. You're not safe out at sea. It's not for bees. <laughs> Glitchy boat. I thought bees could get in boats. Apparently I'm incorrect about this. Okay, come on then, bee. I'm gonna get in the boat and you're gonna follow me. Come on. Before it gets to nighttime. It's not, it's very dangerous around here at nighttime. Let's go. Our good old Kiwi sleeping. There you go. There you go. All right, let's put your flower down. And we'll go get you a beehive. The bee has already disappeared. <laughs> Where have you gone? Okay. <laughs> I guess I guess you could hang out here. Right, I have been derailed by the need to help this bee. By the way, guys, you like my stable? <laughs> Was building that between episodes and some pillagers came to attack me. Very rude. Right, we need to go to the shopping district and see if we can find ourselves something bee related. Probably some honeycomb so I can make a hive. If I'm really lucky, someone actually might be selling some hives. Oh look, another bee. I think you're a bit too far for me to take home though. <laughs> Ooh, this is new. <laughs> I like that my head is in this shop. Whose shop is this? Kenny's Books. Oh, I like that a little touch of a little touch of Japanese on there. Let's see. Welcome to Kenny's Books. Our mission is to make blah 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 blah. Every book is the price of one diamond. <gasps> yes! Uh, that is exactly what we want. Oh, fantastic. Oh look, he's used, um, I don't think he would appreciate me stealing his beehives for my bee. <laughs> oh wow. Oh, I definitely need efficiency. Uh, okay, I have 10 diamonds. Don't spend them all, cavers. Ugh. Almost spent all my diamonds. I feel like Tink is the kind of person who might be selling beehive related things. Because he sells a look through everything. Oh, he's selling calcite. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yep. I'll take that for my last diamond. But wait, I have more diamonds. I'm going to try not to spend them all. <laughs> Jin, what are you doing? I'm just gonna leave you there for now. Hey, Tink. Hey, hey, Bruce, how you doing? I'm good. I'm looking for um, bee-related things. So I've, I've rescued a bee, but it has nowhere to live. Hmm, okay, wait, let me check. I think I have some bees. Yeah, of course okay. you do. Of course you do. <laughs> um, how many bees do you have? Uh, just the one. Okay, why don't you take one of these that has two bees inside of it? So you can start <gasps> they your can own have friends! Yay! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, that's uh, cool. Yeah, go ahead, then take it. Uh, two, oh, wow, it actually says two bees, five honey. That's cool. I shall take two bees. Thanks, Dink. Cool. I okay. just spent money at your shop, so I don't feel too bad about taking that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> brilliant. All right, my little bee friend, I have brought you some more friends. Let's see where you are. Bee, bee. Still hiding up here, probably. Yeah, very, very sad, very tired. Right, uh, I'm gonna have to cover those up so that they can't escape. Let's put it here so that we can actually get a fire underneath it. Block these up and no escape. <gasps> Yay, that's it! You went inside with your friends! I'm so happy. And we won't mention to Tink that I bought books from one of his competitors. 
Whilst my bees have been busying away, I've actually been busying myself away and leveling up all my tools. Check it out. I, I did go back to Kenny's bookshop. <laughs> um, but because I have like more kind of leveled up tools now, I was actually able to do some mining. I've actually made the mine down here. I'm gonna have to make like a proper basement at some point, but it's like basically just down here. And I used that special new glass, which actually is really expensive. So I'm gonna need a lot more like amethyst geodes. And I actually found quite a lot of diamonds, but I've decided that mining at level six is way too freaking dangerous. I almost died in lava and I lost one of my diamonds, but I still managed to get a fair few of them. I also went over to the spider farm that Mario made in order to level myself up so I could actually stick things on here. And I got myself a new little friend. Turns out his spider spawner also is really good at spawning axolotls. <laughs> oh yeah, I also bought some name tags. We can use them later. And look at all these diamonds. Oh, we need a new name, guys. Look, isn't she cute? I got her, I got her. <laughs> I may have gotten rid of all my torches though. Even better than that, in my adventures, I actually managed to find another beehive and because I now have a silk dodge pick, I was able to pick it up. Speaking of picks and stuff, guys, um, obviously Tink named one of my tools in this episode, but um, the rest of my tools need names. I think I have one in the comments somewhere for the diamond hoe, but the rest of them don't have anything. I'm very particular, guys. It has to be song names. I don't mind what song, but it has to be a song name. However, I will always accept puns. Now I need to stop procrastinating and actually show you guys what I've been working on out here. <laughs> so this is the beginnings of the canal. I actually would like to use basalt, like where these blocks are going down, but um, I don't have any. <laughs> so I haven't been able to do that, but I do have a nice little river going here. You can see I've built all of this up on that side as well. So it's all kind of level. It is basically lit up underneath there. We don't fill in holes. But we're just gonna ignore that and admire this lovely little bridge. Isn't it cute? I just wanted something really small, kind of like this is like more of an area to like observe the water than actually like anything useful. And I had a look at a map of Suzhou and actually like there's a lot of canals. Like I was kind of wondering if it was just gonna be one going through the city, but actually there's a lot and there's like a moat that goes all the way around. So I think once we start getting the shape of the city, I probably will end up doing like a moat and a whole bunch of other ones. But yeah, this is basically Basically the first one. Um, some of them are going to end up being bigger as well. This is just like a little ditty, a little ditty canal on the um, probably the poorer end of town, I would think. Now, guys, I'm kind of I'm kind of obsessed with bees at the moment. The bees have derailed my mind, and I'm going to stop working on the canal. And I actually have a design for a bee farm that I really want to do. So I'm going to gather my resources, guys, and let's get to it. And here it is guys, our second building, the bee farm. Um, because it's like quite a square building, I tried to kind of break it up a little bit by having like that bit like at the top and you can actually go in it using the ladder at the back. And there's like a little room up here that's not used for anything at the moment, but I guess we could store stuff in it. Maybe even make it into a little shop in the future. The bees have been busying themselves away. Look at that, fantastic. And I've made it so that you can actually access behind here and check on all the shears and things so that I can like change it to bottles if I want to and just get all the bee related things. But I'm afraid guys, that is all the time we have today. Thank you so much for watching this episode. It was, I don't know what my original plan was, but it's, it's bees. <laughs> it's now all about the bees. And I'm actually gonna be doing a live stream very soon. So if you're watching this episode, guys, that live stream will have already happened. And uh, probably I will have made, uh, well, hopefully I will have made a little bit more progress. So in the next episode, we'll see all of that. So until then, guys, have a good one.